Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Today we are going to present our research entitled relationship uh, between construction waste triggers and bin IBS activities in the construction industry Our outline of the presentation uh, first introduction, second uh, problem statement, literature review, objective of the study, methodology, result and discussion, and the last uh, conclusion. On the direction, uh, building information modeling beam is implemented in Malaysia construction industry to improve industri industrialized uh, building system IBS performance in terms of time, cost, and quality. Beam provides a platform for improving communication between stakeholders and can help uh, with design, digital representation, project scheduling, and cost and time management. The construction industry uh, development board CIDB has made the BIM mandatory for project worth uh, more than 10 million and advocates its integration into every construction project. Construction waste is a problem in Malaysia and needs specific regulation to engage in waste management hierarchy. BIM IBS system can reduce construction waste by improving project schedule, detecting clash during construction, and making better decisions based on information. Our problem segment construction waste is a major problem in the construction industry and is not well managed in Malaysia. The increasing number of new developments and remodel building is contributing to the growing generation of the construction waste in the country. The evaluation of beam uh, IBS system in all stages of construction could help reduce construction waste innovation. BIM IBS can improve project schedule, detect clash during construction, decrease construction costs and increase efficiency by making better decisions based on information. Waste management can be improved through BMS by reducing waste during design and production, improving color collaboration on site and gaining access to new sustainable opportunities. Uh, a bit on literature review. Uh, construction waste management and industry in Malaysia. Construction industry impact environment, well-being and health. Construction generates uh, significant amount of waste. Malaysian government takes steps into minimize waste generation. Construction waste management includes strategies to reduce waste and utilize it more effectively. Most common method of uh, reusing uh, construction waste is no longer sustainable. IBS developed in Malaysia to deal with the housing shortage. Malaysian climate requires IBS specific skill and training program. IBS allow for mass produce, high quality building. IBS reduce labor intensity and standardized construction resulting in a cost saving and improved quality. Malaysian building construction industry is still low in IBS implementation. BIMS integrate data acquisition, exchange, realization and analysis during construction project life cycle. BIM enhance quality of design and construction by providing support. BIM based design validation reduce error and rework. BIM validation could help achieve zero waste goal. And then level of acceptance for BIM IBS activities, nation builders recognize benefit of IBS but face challenge. Poor implementation strategy and lack of understanding among the practitioners, strict regulation could help promote wider adoption of IBS and BIM. Our objective of the study to assess the extent of adoption of BIM IBS activity in the construction industry to investigate the relationship between construction waste, triggers and mean IBS activity at all stages of construction to determine the, to determine the effectiveness of beam IBS activity in the reducing construction waste. Our methodology, the research methodology is based on uh, uh, using questionnaire. The questionnaire will be distributed to the contractor in different regions. The questionnaire will uh, consist of three main sections, section A, general, general function, Section B, question about level of bin IBS activities. Section C, question about whether the use of bin IBS activity help to reduce construction waste. Uh, result from uh, respondent on the demographics. Uh, 
gender uh, 60% from male and uh, 40% from female and then for zone uh, 88% from central zone um, company uh, contractor 59% and then uh, highest and then for sector 93% from the private sector and then for collocation uh, highest contribution to the data 68% from a degree holder designation mm, most of the respondent uh, engineer uh, years of experience uh, 3 to 5 years experience 78% a woman in IBM or uh, an IBS project, uh, uh, 48% less than three years experience involvement in uh, BIM IBS. And then the last one, organization size, uh, company, 63%. Uh, most of the company have uh, 20 to 50 um, employees. Uh, next, respondent exposure level. On the question away on uh, being IBS benefit, 100% uh, say yes, they are aware that uh, being IBS has uh, potential uh, benefits. Uh, on the question, how long have uh, you been using IBS in construction industry? Uh, majority respondent. Uh, involve uh, three to five years experience, uh, experience in IBS construction industry using IBS mm. on to what extent does your company implement to use the IBS in construction project 26 to 50 percent of project contribute to 67 percent uh, of the respondent uh, next on how long have uh, you been uh, using BIM in construction industry uh, one to two years experience of uh, contribute 41% to what extent does your company implement the use of BIM in construction industry BIM in construction industry uh, they are 26 to 50% of our project contribute 65% of respondents say they are uh, using BIM in the construction project Next on which construction phase of BIM elements are being used within your organization? 91% said on the construction phase. 5% uh, on planning phase. 1% uh, execution phase. And 2% on uh, operation and maintenance phase. And then on the how will you explain the present and the potential use of being in your organization uh, the version level we are currently use beam 56 percent next on assistant uh, acceptance level according to the category uh, the highest rank personal competency category uh. Second rank technology quality category on uh, third organization and the last one behavior control on IBS and B activity towards waste reduction. IBS activity towards control waste reduction, uh, the score mean 4.57 uh, on a beam activities to construction waste reduction 4.57 also, it's almost the same the exposure uh, level and on, on the correlation analysis on all the variable uh, organization uh, category technology personal behavior benefit of uh, IBS benefit of BIM B activities so the data from correlation shows that uh, more all of them is a uh, significant they are got a correlation and uh, the correlation uh, value more than 0.5 on the conclusion 
the research explore relationship between uh, construction waste trigger and all beam activity at all stages of construction a prediction model based on the mean value and regression was developed to assess the extent of beam IBS certain in the construction industry as well as how beam and IBS activity contribute to waste reduction. The following implications have been made regarding the proposed uh, research objective. A large segment of Malaysia was unaware and I'm prepared for beam based is submission even though they perceive the benefit such as improved communication efficiency, higher quality information exchange, innovative design and new business quality that can be created through BIM. The industry, the industry is willing to exchange existing procedure and learn new concept and technology as evident by the wait and see approach taken by most companies in the organization profession. The Malaysian construction industry should improve its waste construction management in order to reduce waste construction. At early stage, redu reducing Construction waste can be achieved through the implementation of the BIM system. Malaysian practices in the construction industry are not well adapted to the BIM IBS system. This method help in reducing construction waste in Malaysia. Thank you.